Hello friends, welcome to the multiple choice question answer series of certified in the risk and information system control presented by Let's Learn Risk set 44. Let's start with the today's first question. The first question states, when developing risk scenario for an enterprise, which of the following is the best approach? The options are the top down approach to consider overall business impact. Option B the top down approach because it has the support of senior management. Option C the bottom up approach to understand the impact of system outages more accurately. And option D the top down and the bottom up approach because they have different perspective. Friends, the correct answer is option D, the top down approach and the bottom up approach because they have different perspective. Friends, because the top down and bottom up risk scenario development integrates both perspective. Right? In a top down approach, one start from the overall business objectives and perform an analysis of the most relevant and probable risk scenario affecting the business objectives. Right? Similarly, the bottom-up approach builds on general risk scenario to create more concrete and customized scenario applied to the individual enterprise solution. Right? So, a combined approach afford the best of both. Right? Let's discuss the other options which are incorrect. Coming to the option A, that is a top-down approach to consider overall business impact. Friends, this option is incorrect because the business impact is important and IT risk must be measured relative to the associated business practices. However, an exclusive assessment from business's objective will lack detail grounded in the daily processes. Right? Moving to the option B, that is a top-down approach because it has the support of senior management. Friends, this option is also incorrect because management by in uh, is essential, but the risk scenario should also consider the impact of individual system outages. Right? The option C, that is also incorrect, which states that the bottom-up approach to understand the impact of system outages more accurately. Friends, because the bottom-up approach is too narrow, right? The risk cannot be separated from the business objective. That's why this option is also incorrect, right? Moving to the next question. The next question states, the greatest benefit of performing a periodic disaster recovery site exercise is to ensure the options are option A, the continued suitability of the contingency facilities. Option B, the continued availability of data sent from the primary site. Option C, that the correct equipment is at the contingency facilities. And option D, the security measure at recovery sites are the same as the primary site. Friends, the correct answer is option a that is the continued suitability of the contingency facility this option is correct because the greatest benefit is continued suitability of the contingency facility because if the facility itself is not suitable then even with data and the personal resources the disaster recovery plan will not work right next let's discuss the other options which are incorrect Option B, which states the continued uh, availability of data sent from the primary site. This option is incorrect because simply having data available at an alternate site is not the reason for periodic testing because data alone will not help in disaster recovery. Right? Moving to the option C, that the correct equipment is at the contingency facilities. This option is also incorrect because Ensuring that the correct equipment is at the recovery site is a subset of site suitability requirement. Moving to the option D, 
that is also incorrect which states that the security measure at recovery sites are the same as the primary site. This option is incorrect because testing security measures at recovery site is a subset of a site suitability requirement. Right? That's why the option A is correct. Friends, here we come to the end of set 44 of multiple choice question and answer series of CRISC. Thank you for watching and please do subscribe to our channel and stay tuned for more updates. Thank you.